So not only did, did Gita get picked for just an unbelievable dream that she has, uh, she's done some incredible things for our company as well. We're going to go back to India and see some amazing things, but uh, she's working really hard. And so is David to fundraise, and uh, so many of you that can support her in this trip. Super excited for you. Magic in the air, cause something is waiting for me. Oh, oh, oh. I've been good, but I can last. Hurry Christmas, hurry now. I can't wait to see what's on. I'm Tamara Fackrell and I'm an owner of Land Voice and when Jake told me the idea of the dream giveaway I was so excited about it because we have a lot of humanitarian projects that we do and and we just love the spirit of giving and so to be able to give an opportunity for someone else to reach their dream is something that's really exciting. Gita stood out immediately. I was like oh that would be the most amazing dream to go back to her homeland of India. I can barely even talk about it because I feel really connected to Gita and I just love that she wants to go back and give. So we actually, Jake and I loved Gita's dream from the beginning, but we didn't feel like it was fair for us to choose. And so we actually had a committee put together um, at Land Voice to be able to go through and talk about it, that we weren't a part of it because we didn't want people to feel like we were giving preferential treatment. And so when Jake told me that Gita was going to be the winner, I was that was something that I was like, yes, like so excited for her to be able to reach her dream. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. India has several languages. Um, Indian states were created based on linguistic lines. So most of the states speak its own language. Um, India has officially recognized 22 languages and it has like 29 states. So most of the Indians, and also India has several dialects. Uh, some, as per some census, um, 800 dialects are spoken in India. So that's too many languages. And think about it, if, if all the 50 states in U.S. spoke their own different language, it would be crazy, but we somehow manage it. 40% of Indians are vegetarians. So almost 500 million people are vegetarians. That's, that's crazy. India is home for all the major religions in the world. Um, one of the oldest religions in the world is Hinduism and it dates back to 5,000 years. Hi guys, I'm going to tell you some interesting facts about India. And one of them is um, Indians invented uh, shampoo. Um, they, they used to wash their hair with uh, uh, fruits and some nuts. And when European traders came to India for trade, they saw the idea of washing hair with shampoo and they liked it and they took back the idea and that's how world came to know about shampoo. Um, Indians introduced yoga to the world. Yoga rejuvenates mind and body. The largest religious gathering happens in India. It happens every 12 years once and it's the largest religious gathering in the whole world. And um, lots of devotees gather on the banks of river Ganges and approximately 75 million people gather every 12 years and the gathering is so huge that it can be viewed from space. To see where I came from, it's pretty simple. I've never been back and just want to see where I, where I came from. What are you looking forward to the most? Serving the children at the schools, giving them an opportunity to know that there's something greater than what's there. What's the biggest thing or concern on your mind? How spicy the food is. You Everything like else I can embrace, but just to see how spicy the food is. Do you like the spicy food? Tell us, tell us what you like about spicy food. <laughs> 
that it's really spicy. <laughs> I don't know how, how I'll handle the, the spice level because I can handle spicy, but I can't handle Indian spice. Okay. What do you want to take away from this experience? The gratitude of the opportunity I had to be given an opportunity to have something better. To go give some school kids a chance to have a better life, to more deeply understand the culture that my mom is from. I'm looking forward to seeing the kids be excited about something new and sharing with them and then them sharing their lives with us. And I'm excited for the shopping. And I'm excited to climb a tree and eat a fruit. Right I'm going because Gita invited me. And <laughs> I'm also going because I want to experience the culture and I really want to, for the charity, it's going to be really awesome. It's going to be really awesome to see the Taj Mahal. I'm really curious about how crowded it is and I want to ride on a rickshaw and an elephant <laughs> and I want to eat some authentic curries. Yeah. Yeah, um, to see my family members, to see my parents, um, and also to enjoy this vacation to show a um, lot of places to uh, David, Geeta, and Tisha. We are planning to do charity um, in a school um, in my village. Uh, we want the kids to enjoy, uh, we want the kids to be motivated. Um, I hope we'll be able to do that. I'm going to India to meet my parents and to see Golden Triangle with you guys to enjoy all the uh, food in India and to do lots of shopping there. I'm looking forward to make good memories and uh, enjoy and eat a lot of home-cooked food uh, from my mom's hand and look around like see monuments and palaces and see beautiful Taj Mahal, which is one of the world wonders. I'm looking forward about the charity which you guys are doing in India. Yeah, I want to experience that and uh, go to that village and uh, see how you guys um, interact with the kids. I don't like flying. I hate the turbulence, it freaks me out, and it's gonna be a long flight, so I'm not looking forward to that. A stupid airplane ride. 10 hours to Amsterdam from Salt Lake, and then waiting a few hours, getting on another airplane, and another 10 hours to Bangalore. Yeah, I do not like flying, and but hopefully I survive. Uh, the travel time, uh, we, we have two long flights, um, 10 hours each. That's the most concerning part. We are traveling with a baby, so we are worried about it. We don't know how the baby is going to behave. <laughs> Last time we had very bad. <laughs> Very bad experience, so that's the most concerning part. I'm concerned about Geeta because of the spicy food and also about a little bit of traffic in India. I want to take away some beautiful saris, <laughs> some awesome jewelry, and some awesome memories, and of course, a full belly. <laughs> an appreciation for the people, an appreciation for the culture, the food, driving on the wrong side of the street, driving like maniacs, overcrowded cities. <laughs> Plus, Gita's from there. So, 
We're not actually going to her neighborhood, but we're going to be really close. A lot of good experience, memories. Um, we are traveling with our best friends and we want to have very good time. And I hope we'll be able to do many more trips like this and enjoy. A lot of good memories, which uh, we spend like 30 days with you guys. All the lot um, memories with my family and also you guys. And we would like to make an album of that as well. I forgot the most important thing I want to take away is a little Indian baby, maybe two. <laughs> <laughs>
Fuck. Bengaluru Airport. The steering wheel's in the wrong spot. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to India. You're gonna die again. Yeah, because we're on the wrong side of the road. Well, we're on the right side of the road from India. Eagles. Those are not hawks.
turn right and then turn left. Mm. Oh, it all I'm makes sense now. I'm trying to move. <laughs> oh it's my gosh. Turn left into Minakshi Kano Street. Look at that little calf. Oh, Everybody has the right. <laughs> yeah. That's Happy Sankranti! Thank you! Thank you! Uh, father, daughter, daughter, mother. Bunny! Here, let's get a family picture. Am I coming in here? Yeah.
But I was recording and I was not recording. Yeah, you could have just handed him out. What is this? What is this drink called? Coffee. Coffee, coffee. Oh, coffee. Okay, good. That's a good name. I like that name. Tisha, do you like it? Gita? Everybody? Cheers. Thank you for your help. My driving depends upon the navigator. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, in how that, fast he is or how slow he is. <laughs> in that case, we're both doomed. <laughs> Welcome to all honorable guests, officers of education department, donors, inspires, STMC president and members, government high school and government higher primary school headmaster and the teacher.
ಅತಿಥಿಗಳಿಗೂ ವೇದಿಕೆ ಮೇಲೆ ಸ್ವಾಗತ All the respected officers and guests on the dais and all the people assembled before the dais and the staff members of our school, the students in VIH are really coming from poor families. They are coming. The wealthy people sending their children to the private schools. The students coming to the government institutions are very poor, poor among them. Knowing this fact, came to help our poor students. Shri 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 Virudhu Swami Yoko, Palakaya Sar Swami, Ago, Chikamadeviya Padaranda Virudhu Vansi, Vatana Arkanika. ವೇದಿಕೆ ಮೇಲೆ ಎಲ್ಲ ಗಣ್ಯರಿಗೂ ನನ್ನ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ನಾನು ಒಂದು ಎರಡು ಮಾತು ಆಡಕ್ಕೆ ಇಷ್ಟಪಡ್ತೇನೆ ಮೊದಲಾಗಿ ಎಲ್ಲ ಆದರ್ಶವಾಗಿ ತಿಳ್ಕೊಂಡು ಮಾದರಿಯಾಗಿ ತಿಳ್ಕೊಂಡು ನೀವು ಸಹ ನಿಮ್ಮ ಕೈಲಾದಷ್ಟು ನಮ್ಮ ಸರ್ಕಾರಿ ಶಾಲೆಗಳಿಗೆ Thank <laughs> you. 
It's the main man. The main man. The main man, Bore. Dore. Not Dore. Bore. Looks good. Yeah. Looks good. Hi. Good dancing skills. Yeah. Oh, one second. Yep. <laughs> What is it? What's in there? What is it? Show me. Show me. What is it? American Penido. Nella Hakan on Puddy. What is it? What is it? What is it?
How? Rishi and a shoes place. You guys have done more of it. Good morning. Here we are on our way to the airport in Bangalore, heading up to Delhi. Oh no. No, no, no. Our cab driver. Hiding out in the back. <laughs> Gita, shoe. Are you excited for Delhi? What are you so most excited about? Dust. Dust. <laughs> <laughs> Rishi, you excited for Delhi? Yes, I've never seen Delhi. So this is wow. my first time. So I have seen it. It was so I'm, much I'm populated last time. This yeah. time it will be more. Like, yeah, I have I've seen it like 10 years ago and this time it will be even more. Oh, wow. yeah. Yeah, we have to buy what? masks. Oh, mask is out of the place. I know, I have masks. Every lighting. Mask is out of the Yeah, we've got it. Big ones. Don't break it out. Rishi's driving as you can see. <laughs> There's just no steering wheel. Agra. And here we are for breakfast. Are you guys okay being on camera? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> What do you think of this place, you guys? I love it. It's, it's, it's fun. You know what the world is fun? Yeah. Elephant. We love this place. Are you the the host? Yes, yes. Awesome. Awesome. And what is your name? Pratipa. Pratipa. Thank you. 
Well, here we are walking to the Taj Mahal. Sushi? Really? No. Really? What? No way. Yeah, I would have never thought. <laughs> no, this is this is Hagra. This is the melting pot. Melting pot of all the countries, yeah. Okay. Getting tickets for the Taj Mahal. This is our guide here. Hello, tell, tell us my your name. name is Vishal. I'm a tour guide in Agra. So, ah. how are you guys? Aha, uh -huh. really good. Your smile is good. <laughs> yeah, really good. <laughs> and the most important thing about the Taj Mahal, no machine used in it. All carving done by hand, without machine. Ah. Because everything is symmetry here. Yeah, you can see. Sides. I will show you inside symmetry. Okay? Mm. Why we call best building in the world? Best building. In the world. It's marble and it's heavy doom. Uh, Why it is a best building? If you building? give me the right answer, I will give you one chocolate for all. One, one chocolate. <laughs> what do you think Why it is? Why we yeah. call best building in the world? Because of the structural. There's no pillars uh, on the inside. Only one time. Only one time. You're done. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I know you can give me answer. This, 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 this. You can give me the other architecture. Huh? Architecture. You? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Are you looking colorful work? It looks yeah. like painting and paints. Yeah. That's not a painting. It's not a paint. These all are gemstones. Gemstones. Gems. Best quality gemstone in the world. That's why we call best building in the world. Oh. Because of gemstones. Oh. Many gemstones used inside. Hmm. You can touch and feel. It's not a painting. Hmm. Like all are gems. They cut the marble and cut the gemstone and fix gemstones. Okay, nice. And because symbol of love as everybody knows. Right. The king charge up with the Taj Mahal in memory of his favorite wife. That lady name was? Favorite wife? Asabona, yes. She's, she's my first and the last. She's my first no, I don't believe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, please don't mind. Okay? So I'll. And you can see this white building, Taj Mahal, start to build 1631 and complete in 1653. Okay? Okay? And why King Shada use gemstone inside? If you give me the right answer, I will give you one. So, so, so people couldn't easily steal it. Because painting would now wash the way and it wouldn't, it wouldn't last long. When the sun comes down, it shines a certain way. <laughs> For foreigners. <laughs> you wanted to make it unique. That time Mumtaz, by the, Mumtaz died. Yeah. She had many tension in her mind. Oh, tensions. You know, uh, I have 14 children who take care of my children. Oh. I have who oh. yeah. take care of my husband. Then, you know, peace of mind and peace of soul.
<laughs> Are we starting with B now for Barry? No, no. Oh, who, who lost? Audrey. Audrey did. I think the girls are coming up with quite a few. Oh, yeah, Adrian. Um. Here's our bucket list item. Rickshaw ride. Get it. Where are we? India. Oh, Malakaude. <laughs> Malakaude. So how do you pronounce the name of this place? Shravana Belagola. 
Oh, one more time. Savana Bella Gola. Savana Bella Gola. Something. Finally, we arrive in Ambar Palace. Mm -hmm. So this is the first part of Ambar Palace. We call the parade ground, Jalep Chow. Mm -hmm. So come to Hinda Palace. Maharaja make the two gates. One gate for himself. This we call the Surat Fort, Sun Gate. Mm -hmm. And another gate we call the Moon Gate, Chand Fort. So general public enter from this gate, and Maharaja and the royal family. Okay.
been so close to an elephant. One by one. Ha, ha, ha.
you slick over here on the uh, the wires. So what do you call this place? Chokidani. Say again. Chokidani. Chokidani. Aha. Chokidani. Here we go. Supposedly this is a pretty cool place. So. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Pick up this line. kind of
here we are, LN's farm. <laughs> LN, yeah. I like your farm. Yeah, fine. Yeah. Uh, how, how is it? Great. How is it? Uh. Are we collect collecting wood for the fire? Oh, uh, yeah. Wood for the fire. Pushpa. Washing with chicken. chicken. Yeah, mutton, mutton. Mutton. Oh, chicken, chicken, chicken. Chicken. Chicken and mutton. Chicken and mutton. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Transferring the meat. It's Grandma Pushpa. <laughs> Onion, turmeric, and salt. We have two Indian grandmas now. Grandma Ashu, Grandma Pushpa. Grandma Indira. And Grandma Indira. She's still not a grandma. All right, three grandmas. Here we go. It looks so good. Look at that. Pushpa, your recipe? Yeah. It looks, looks, it looks really good. Thank you. And that's what you do before you eat on them. You clean them. Taste test. Are you the one who's supposed to test it? Yeah, just yeah. test it. This is the official test. Right now, it's, right now it's too hot. Yeah. Hmm. Is it done? Yeah. Is it good? LN says it's ready. It's time to yeah. eat. Looks so delicious. So, what is this called? Pepper chicken. Pepper chicken. Pepper chicken. Yes. Delicious. Pepper chicken. And who made this? Uh, Nandini made this. Nandini made. Nandini? Yeah. Oh. Wait, she took my food. David, 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 Pushpa, thank you. Very good. Thank you. These are all uh, coconut trees. Coconut trees. Mm -hmm. How many do you have on your property? Number 146. 146. Wow. Oh. That's a large tree. Yeah. Mm -hmm. After that, 
we too we are going to remove all the coconut trees and uh, we we plan of we we are thinking to form uh, three to four towers of uh, apartments here oh wow, oh, wow. Mm, yeah <laughs> so nearly 450 apartments will arise here <laughs> So in with, five years, ten no, years? No, no, no. Uh, shortly, I mean, in the sense, uh, within t two years. Taking a walk in the farm. What is this thing? <laughs> thing is big. Look at that. That's even bigger. <laughs> that is so crazy. <laughs> We saw a couple of cobras. How many cobras are here? Yeah, yeah just, just a few. No. We, yeah, we killed them and ate them. No cobras come out from the uh, Yeah, from the snake hole. He's making another. This could be the one, folks. This could be the winning coconut. What do we try to do? Hey, find a way to Alright. Just keep it here. Nature style. Yeah, glass for a lowly. This is a good one. Oh, this is a good one. How is it, Tish? <laughs> is it fresh? <laughs> that was so much fun. That's the best way to eat Indian food out in the country.